yeah, I, I guess, but at the same time, if you're here, you can literally just hop, hop right over. You don't need the crates at this point. What's the purpose of giving me the crates if... Whatever. Oh, no. Hold on, didn't we already access every door and open it? Hey, Patrick. Wait, that... That says Bill. That says Patrick. Bill is dead. Oh, Jesus. Let's hold X on this bloody, bloody, bloody keyboard. That is... Wow. All right. How's it going, folks? It's the Pancake Renegade here, and welcome back to Dead Island. I hope you all are doing fantastic today. Hope you're all are staying hydrated. Hope you're all staying well fed, and uh, all that all that fun stuff. I uh, I am doing pretty good. You know, still recording this pretty much in the day I recorded, like the last four episodes or so. <laughs> I'm just kind of spaced out between time periods, just because I've stuff to do besides record you know but uh yeah i'm doing pretty good still just trying to balance out the rest of my day with recording but i digress let's get back to the game we uh left off in the last episode taking out vargas recording something for nick which we have to go back to moresby the city of moresby and give give it to him and, uh, we also got Amanda's camera. So, here you go. Oh my god, you have it? Thank you. What a story. Wait till this gets on the air. No one is gonna believe this. I may win an Emmy. Detox rifle mod. Not too sure what that is, but we will always take another blueprint. Let's see, detox rifle mod, a highly poisonous plant and a couple of other ingredients to turn your rifle into the modern equivalent of a bow that fires poisoned arrows. Follow my instructions for a very effective weapon. Two oleander, two metal scrap, two bleach, which we do not have, and one flexible hose. We also need a rifle. A single shot rifle, auto rifle, burst rifle, or defender of the motherland. Not really sure where that last one is, but we may find Anything one yet. Alright, let's go turn our flashlight back off. Let's check our repair weapons. Uh, lowest one's 90. Oh, no, this one's 55. We will repair that. If it gets below, like, 70 or so, we'll probably repair it. We got Sean in here. Alrighty. <clears throat> we have something else to turn in, I thought. Uh, I thought we had another quest here. King of the Swamp, that's talking to Montetero. Death wish, get back to Carter, find David at the River Village. Uh, visit to the pub. Find a way to get to the building. Which is like a brick shit house, so he's hard to miss. Yeah, it's up here. Alright. <clears throat> let's head out of this little safe zone. Now let's check behind the warehouse, shall we? I'm looking for a big zombie, I guess. Alright, maybe he's up here. Uh no stairs or anything. Oh, we need crates. All right, where am I gonna find? Oh, over here. All right, that works. Let's go put that there. And then we need to find another crate somewhere. I mean, it's gotta be close by, right? I think I see it on that roof over there. Uh, let's go, let's go here. Although, I mean, that's not really my fault necessarily. That's just a random placement. That is super bizarre. It's on the roof, of all things. I mean, yeah, I, I guess. But at the same time, if you're here, you can literally just hop, hop right over. You don't need the crates at this point. What's the purpose of giving me the crates if... Whatever. Alright, we have to obtain the warehouse key from the mechanic. Let's, uh, boom. Oh, jeez, that scared me. I was not expecting that. Why do I have a battered broomstick? Pick up that weapon, and that weapon, and not the battered broomstick. 
Wait, if you cut off their head and then you kick, can you technically kick their head? That'd be kind of funny. Alright, well, now that we figured that out... Uh, what you got? Shrink to 31? Alright, it's not terrible. But yeah, that, that was... That's not necessarily on me. That's just a really strange placement for a crate. I'll probably go ahead and speed that up uh, when I edit this video and post. Alright, I found the key. Okay. Oh, hold it. That's it. Good job. Help yourself to whatever you need. If there's a zombie in here... Oh, wait, hold on. What you got? Uh, <laughs> kind of got stuck there. Oh, no, I'm selling that. Uh, personal ID. I suppose I'll take that. Defective shotgun. I will take that. We do not have a shotgun. Feeble Hanbo. I mean, these are kind of just... Except for the shotgun, these are kind of just meh. Take a look. Uh, were you expecting something better from this place? Because I know I was. Alright, lowest is 68. Where's that? Yeah, we'll go ahead and upgrade that. Or repair that, I should say. Alright. Uh, let's also fast travel to the river village. Let's go ahead and fast travel there. Let's go ahead and sell. Let's pick up this uh, spade. Whatever you got on you and these bad weapons over here. Oh, uh, that says hold X. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, jump on over to this trader and sell him all these crappy weapons. Thanks to you. Yep, yep. Thanks to you. Or thanks to me, your business is open. That's cool. Slaughtering nail hammer. Hanbo, we're keeping that because she cousin's gold. Selling that. And then we're keeping this shotgun, probably putting that in our we'll storage or something. Again. Oh, that's so cool. Wow. Yeah, I'm super excited for you. Alright, so we have to get back to Carter. We have the little pins. We have to, uh, Prince. Sorry, not not Pince. Um, we have to find David in the river village, which is some somewhere. Is there a quest here? Oh, that's, that's Machitero. Okay. Uh... I suppose we'll put our waypoint to go to Carter, and maybe we'll find something. Uh, maybe we'll find David. Hello. Uh, let's go take that. Oh, oh yeah, hi. Hey, I'm David, Claire's son. Have you really found my mom? That I have. I was sure I'd never see her again. Thank God for Machutero. He told me I could stay here until help arrived. Please tell her that I'm safe, and that I'm here, and to please be careful. Thank you. You're very welcome. Tell Claire you found her son. I'll take that frying pan. Uh, hey Carter. Alright then. I hope he fucking suffered. I'll take that shark mod. What is that? Shark mod. What is this? I like all these names. <laughs> Shark mod. The thing I managed to compile is a dream of every homegrown designer with killer inclinations, or rather every murderer with an affinity to DIY. As God is my witness, I wish you didn't have to use that toy, but it's out of my hands. Using it will turn these bastards into bloody scraps. You need a sledgehammer, constructive hammer, or a construction hammer, or maul, or Gabriel sledgehammer. Why specifically Gabriel sledgehammer? Alright, so we actually finished both of those quests there. Alright, that's, uh, that's cool. Let's head back down, sell the crappy weapons we just picked up, and then we shall uh, we'll head back to the city of Moresby real quick before we uh, continue on the main quest with the we going for the boat. All right, just because I want to get spy game done and little prince, we have to tell Claire we found her son. And Claire is thanks where? to you. Whoa, thanks to me. That's so cool. Sell, sell, sell. We'll open for business again. Whoa. <clears throat> Alright, Claire is... Where's Claire, actually? Um... Oh, the overpass. Alright. Jungle antenna. I don't really remember where the antenna is. Oh, was it where we found the... Where we killed Vargas? Uh, overpass game. I think so. Alright, so Claire is down here. Hey Claire, how's it going? 
Found your son. Thank God. You found him. I'm so happy David is safe. I'll join him as soon as all this settles down. Take this. It's the least I can do to repay you. A rifle ammo blueprint. Hey, that is not shabby. Thank you. Alright, cool. Now that that's done, we are going to head to the church in Moresby. Because I believe that's... No, let's go to the... Uh, let's go to the warehouse because I think we need to go to the abandoned house in Moresby and they're pretty much scattered all over the place But I think the closest one we can get to Is from the warehouse if not we're just fast travel to the church. It's it's fine. It doesn't really matter Let's stop by the trader though uh, Homemade cleaver that's not bad. We are saving up money, but that ooh, That is going to be Something I would want to purchase. I'll just purchase one Just purchase one this person. That's right. They quarantined the island. Looks like the army's not coming to the rescue then. I guess they wrote us off. Whatever they're doing, they clearly don't give a rat's ass about us. I need to put some thought into this. All right, old Smokey mod. Let's check out what that is. Old Smokey. Looks like the person next to him has a quest for us. Figured out a way to administer to those rotting crazies a dose of electrocution they will not soon forget, if they're capable of remembering anything in the first place. I made a list of several required elements. All you need to do is put them together with a sound machete, and you'll get a really awesome spark crackling shiv. Funny. Hold on. Hold on. Um, 80... Yeah, we're fine. Hey, what's up? We sent our friend Bill to the police station to get some important oh, data that might just help us get off this bloody island. Bill hasn't come back yet. And we're worried something happened to him. Would you be willing to look for him? This information he was looking for could prove to be very useful. I mean, sure. Yes. Good. I would say you should probably leave sooner than later. Wow. You're astute, aren't you? All right. Let's head out of here. Let's go to the police station. I am not dealing with you, big guy. Just gonna run up the stairs. That's very cool. Alright. Patrick. What in the world is. Patrick, hold on. We came here looking for Bob. We. We found Patrick at the other place. Patrick was in Nick's apartment. Two hundred locked. Hack and slash. Kill two hundred fifty zombies using edge from melee weapons. Go on, go on. Yeah, that ain't working for you, Chief. All right. Anyway, we're gonna sluggish pistol. Ooh, that's solid. I will take that though. Oh no. Hold on. Didn't we already access every door and open it? Hey, Patrick. Pa wait, that. That says Bill. That says Patrick. Bill is dead. Oh, Jesus. Listen, you have to help us here. The data he was looking for are emergency radio frequencies. They're on the computer in the chief's office. They might help us to get in contact with the outside world. Yeah, all right. Sure. Looks like we're uh, going after some, some data then. Can I... Oh, yeah, let's open this door. Oh, no, you're there. No, thank you. I'm not dealing with that. If that's the case. Pretty sure I've already opened all these doors, but it's cool. I'll just chug some energy drinks. Man, it's been a while, huh? Kind of feels like it anyway. Oh, we're going to the chief's office. I know where that is. Okay. take that money though all right let's go search that oh dang all 
right, chief's office is over this way. What's that say? Oh, <laughs> classy. Very classy. Uh, that's the wrong room. Is that over here? And we just gotta pretty much run through all this stuff. Chief's office is right here. Um. Hold on. Nope. There we go. Three, four. Ooh, when he had something on him. Oh, no, that was the homemade cleaver we had. All right. Let's hold X on this bloody, bloody, bloody keyboard. That is, wow. All right. Deliver the data to Patrick. Maybe this there's is a good place if you want ever, uh, ever want to farm like electronic components and stuff. Police station's a great place for that. Supermarket's good for like energy drinks and stuff. Although you can't really farm those, I'd say. I don't think I came in this room last time I was in the police station. Alright, let's just run back out because we have no real interest in being here. These are them, huh? Talk to Nick. He'll understand what the hell these frequencies mean. Maybe we'll even get some bloody help here finally. Maybe. You can give me a reward. Hey, 3600. That's not terrible. Challenge progress updated. Undead presidents. Oh, okay. Uh, well, Nick. Hello? He, he said talk to you. Uh, I only have continuous quests. Apparently. Some how? Some way, some where to look over the rainbow. All right, um, guess I'll raid your apartment. Lemon juice, another energy drink. Don't mind if I do. I yoink. All right, Nick, you got anything to say? I shall take your silence as a no. Now I'm gonna walk out of here and I'm gonna come right back in, okay? And I want you to give me a quest. If you don't give me a quest, I'll be a little bit upset. If you do me, a if you do give me a quest, I'll also be a little bit upset. So this is a lose-lose situation for you, Nick. Either you give me a quest, and uh, I continue down that storyline or whatever you and your buddy have, or I don't, and I get cliffhangered. And no one likes cliffhangers. Give me a quest. Give me a quest. Give me a quest. Give me a quest. Nothing? Dang. You guys, uh... You didn't really correspond on this very well, did you? No? No? Alright, well, that's gonna have to do it for today's episode, ladies and gents. Uh, yeah, I... Patrick's like, oh, Maybe well, something in here. I'll give these numbers, the frequency numbers to Nick. And then just, nope. You can't be bothered to walk five feet, give it to him, and then give me a quest. But, you know, I'm sure in three episodes I'll be back here trying to do something you didn't do now. But, all right. Anyways, that is going to have to do it for today's episode, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you all enjoyed. Hope you all uh, like the, the floating chair in the corner. Um, and yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.